a newborn in a family of men to be a newborn in a family of men to be suspected to be positive for the red mutation on screening the preferred age for prophylactic thyroidectomy should be a newborn in a family of men to be a newborn in a family of men to be suspected to be positive for the red mutation on screening the preferred age for prophylactic thyroidectomy should be now this is a case of men syndrome and men to syndrome you know is having a very high affinity for uh, medullary thyroid cancer so let us try to understand this let us try to understand whenever we talk about screening whenever we talk about screening in case of men too screening in case of men too before that you should be knowing that men too is of two types 2a and 2b 2a and 2b and remember in 2a also we have mtc in 2b also we have mtc we also have pheochromocytoma as a part pheochromocytoma as a part of 2a yeah and then we have some parathyroid abnormalities we have some mucosal gliomas we have some hushpung disease lot of things are there now talking about men 2 syndrome let us talk about men 2 syndrome whenever we have a newborn whenever we have a newborn in family of men too newborn in family of men too what to do he may or she may be suspicious and we have to check for what mutation we have to check for red proto oncogene mutation now if the red mutation is negative then men too this is ruled out this is ruled out if the red mutation is positive if the red mutation is positive then there is an increased suspicion and now the cancer which we screen for is mtc because that is universally present in all so now what to what to go for we go for pentagastrin pentagastrin stimulated pentagastrin stimulated calcitonin levels calcitonin levels so when we talk about pentagastrin stimulated calcitonin levels now if red mute red proto oncogene mutation is positive that doesn't mean always the patient will have so if it is not elevated if it is not elevated then you will have to go for annual follow up annual follow up the same thing if it is found to be elevated then you have to understand that there is increased risk of medullary thyroid cancer and therefore we need to do a total thyroidectomy so you need to remove the thyroid and this is without any problem so we say prophylactic now when we talk about prophylactic total thyroidectomy the next very important thing is at what age at what age do you know for men 2a men 2a the cancer usually happens after 7 to 8 years therefore before 5 to 7 years you go for for a patient of men 2b the malignancy usually happens by 3 to 5 years so before the first year you will have to go so let us see this question it's a case of men 2b and therefore the answer should be c c is the answer here 